Here it writes, iPhone 10 error 4013. Run cosmetic inspection of the motherboard first. The motherboard is not deformed or water damaged. Let's get the motherboard installed and check. Press the power button. The phone enters into recovery mode automatically. Judging by this, the motherboard comes with restore failure. And therefore the phone cannot enter into the system normally. Let's restore the phone and check whether it comes with error 4013. Connect the phone to the computer. Restore the phone with 3U tools. The phone can be restored normally. What's more, the phone can be normally activated after restore. Go to Settings General About. We can check baseband info here. We can confirm now that the motherboard is normal. The fault is probably related to other parts. Get the earpiece speaker and sensor flex cable and front camera flex cable installed. Turn on the phone. The phone is stuck on Apple logo and keeps restarting. Judging by this, the fault is related to the earpiece speaker and sensor flex cable or the front camera flex cable. Disconnect the earpiece speaker and sensor flex cable. Press the power button to turn on the phone. The phone turns on normally. We can confirm now that the fault is related to the earpiece speaker and sensor flex cable. Check the earpiece speaker and sensor flex cable. The flood illuminator module is moldy. Fix the earpiece speaker and sensor flex cable with high temperature tape. Heat with hot air gun. Remove the flood illuminator module. We can see that its bonding pad is severely corroded. Apply some paste flux to the bonding pad. Clean the bonding pad with soldering iron. Then continue to apply solder paste to the severely corroded pad. Clean with PCB cleaner afterwards. Once done, 
apply some paste flux to the bonding pad. Get the flood illuminator module in the right position. Solder with hot air gun. Then get the earpiece speaker and sensor flex cable installed. Connect the battery. Press the power button. The phone turns on normally. Since the two flex cables were not connected during previous restore, we need to restore again with the two connected. So that Face ID can work normally. Put the phone into DFU mode. Then connect the phone with computer. Restore the phone with the help of 3U tools. The phone can be normally restored. Once completed, the phone enters into the system normally. Face ID setup is also normal. Fault cleared.